Hey guys, welcome back. Today, I know it's been a very long time since I've done a video, but yeah, here you go. And yeah, loads of people have been asking me to do tutorials or how to make the stuff I make. So today, I'm going to be showing you how to make a trench coat for a Lego figure using only a Lego cape of your choice. So as you can see here, I've made one for Jack Sparrow because I think it looks quite good. Makes him look a bit more accurate and moving. Ah uh, yeah, basically this was just a normal navy blue cape that I painted brown. And it's actually very easy to do this. So basically all you want to do, get a normal Lego cape. This is a trench coat I've already made. Um, let's just get out of the way Jack. This is a trench coat I've already made. You can see it kind of resembles a Lego cape. These two bits at the top are where the loops used to go that go, the neck brackets that go around the neck. All you need to do basically is cut those off, right? And then make a small hole underneath them with scissors or something and sort of make, widen it up to um, make it the good size for the Lego minifigure's arms to go through. And then all you have to do, take the minifigure's arms off, put them in these holes and sort of put it back on. And as you can see, here's a finished one that I've done for, from Neo from Matrix. It looks quite good, and you can it also um, if you leave some sort of flaps from the neck bracket, it kind of looks like a collar, which also really looks nice in my opinion. And yeah, it looks really good. Yeah, so um, also if you want to do, you can sort of cut a little triangle at the bottom to make it look more realistic to real life. Yeah, a lot of people use Cape Madness capes for this sort of thing. Because Lego doesn't actually make trench coats, but if you're like me and you don't really want to pay for shipping and everything, it's, it's just a really simple way to make a really nice looking trench coat for a Lego figure. So yeah, there you go. I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, it was quite a short video, but I hope you found it effective in making your own trench coat for Lego figures. Yeah, I hope you enjoyed and I'll hopefully make more videos soon with more stuff I've been making. So yeah, thanks and see ya.